All right, everybody. Welcome back. Welcome back to another episode of King is King. K ah. King's, King's Cave Ochenta, King. I, I cannot. I want you to say it five times fast. Five, no, King's Cave Ochenta, King's, King, yeah, King's Cave 80, King's Cave 80. I know, I know, I know. I'm sorry I'm a little bit uh, slow right now. A little rusty, huh? We're a little, a little, rusty. little rusty. You guys may not see it because only we only miss one Wednesday. And it feels like forever. But it feels like forever. Um, I'm, 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 I'm a lot better now. I was, yeah, I was your your health, man. Uh, I mean, that's that's what's more important than anything else. No, thank you, thank you. But I was I was going through. I, I went through a rough, rough patch, man. I was, man, like, I was already thinking. I was making a list of what I was gonna take <laughs> for this. For this game, I, 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 I already left uh, instructions to Claudia not not to sell anything to Carlos. Do not sell oh, the other covers. That's nice. So do not yeah. give them to me. Right? Oh yeah, right. I'm gonna give them to you. Yes. How nice. Uh, no, nah, he said yes. Ah, welcome, welcome, Mr. Yes. How you doing? Hi, Hi guys. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Hi guys. I, I, I've been doing good. My wife, my wife was like, "Hey man, you gotta go out of, get out of the house, man. What are we doing? Where's the podcast? <laughs> yeah. When are you gonna podcast? go to the podcast? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, I, I need you out of here. <laughs> yeah, that's what it is. That's good. That's good. Nah, man. You know, you're always welcome here. Um, <laughs> nah, man. Yeah, it was, it was, it was, it was, and it was exactly when I was like, you know, through my birthday and. Oh, yeah. Even though we filmed that uh, that episode, that the Spanish last the You're last episode, in Spanish, there, man. I, know I that. was I was almost kind of like sweating. I was like, it, it was bad. It was bad. It was, uh, but uh, and it, it got worse after that. Uh, I I just I just couldn't lift my my my, my spirit to to do anything. Yeah, it was, it was I was in pain. Anyways, 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 I don't want to make play a victim. I don't want to like like go back to that place. It was bad. So let's move on. Uh, right now, now here. Mm -hmm. We're here now, uh, but yeah, like I say, a little bit rusty, but but, but now we're we're, we're we're ready to roll. Um, yeah, like uh, we're we're uh, you know some oh, some yeah, merch, got some merch. Yeah, some we gear. have some merch. Nah, nah, nah it's, it's not merch for sale or anything like that. Well, okay, so what what if they? I'm pretty sure they're gonna be asking, like, we like something like that. I mean, if you like, we can, we can probably hook you up with something, but uh, 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 it's not merch that I created for sale or anything like that. A good friend of ours, shout out to Cesar. Yeah. Uh, for my birthday, he gave me those, you know, these tumblers. He printed this, this, this cool nice. shirt. Yeah. Uh, for me, so big, big shout out to, to Cesar. Cesar. He always listens to us. Cesar. Thank you, thank you, brother. Appreciate you so much. Uh, uh, oh, and he's a. Uh, he's starting to get into collecting, right? He's going. He's a uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, mini Ulysses. He's starting <laughs> I mean, to. I mean, a Yuli. Uh, no, he's. He, I I know him. I know him because of my of my job. Because of, I, I've I've always seen him on the in the wedding industry. He's uh -huh. a DJ. I'm a photographer. We always cross paths. This is one of the best DJs that I've ever known here in Houston. He's, he's a great great DJ. But it wasn't until recently where like he was like he he saw one of my TikToks or whatever. And mm -hmm. Like, hey man, I didn't know because I, I kind of like keep it separate from from yeah. from a business from a personal. Mm -hmm. Um, all, all, all about collection It's kind of like separate from from a personal um, accounts or anything like that. But he saw the TikTok. He was like, hey, do you collect? And I show. Oh yeah, I. I, I. And then I he was like a little bit, a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and, and then I show him the podcast and like, oh man, I'm gonna look it up. And then he's like, no, I'm collecting too. And then and we got pretty excited. And yeah, he made it to the store and he was like, yeah, I didn't know you. I, and I, I, for some reason, I feel like I got I got a bad feeling that that oh, yeah, that yeah. something yeah, something yeah, kind of yeah. exploit when he he saw my the collection and he's. I feel like we're bad influences, man. Oh, I sent we, him. Who, I, I, I sent him to your to your collection to your <laughs> to your store. And after that, man, I haven't seen anything but but him buying. Turtles, uh, yeah, and I, mean, I love turtles it. Is like, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I yeah, love it. I love like it. I said, that's what I said. We gotta keep Take the market it easy, going. Cesar. Take it easy, bro. They're like you, you can, you can end up on a. And he has the kids with them, so teach them. Teach yeah, them. Yeah, but, but, but take it easy. Take it easy, <laughs> brother. But now, thank you for sure. Thank you for the tumblers. Yeah, thank you. If thank anybody you. wants some, let me know. I, I can probably start making some some merch. Yeah, so but it was. It wasn't. It was. It, it's, it's not. It's not a. It's not a sponsor or anything like that. We can. But anyways. Mm. Makes the water taste better, huh? I definitely look like look, look, look how look how good I look <laughs> with the pinky up. Um, now, nah, anyways, um, yeah, how you been, man? How's the collection? How's it? Uh, how's mean, it been for this? I mean, long I honest, time. Yeah, it's been a long time. No, I mean honestly, I've been taking it easy on on my personal collection. I think I've been more so uh, buying for the store. Okay, 
buying for the store, you know, making sure the store is uh, stocked up with with a bunch of vintage goodies. So goodie. I, I visited I visited your store this 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 last weekend. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it was it looks pretty refreshing. It looks like it's a lot yeah, a lot of new a lot stuff. Of vintage. I love I love uh, seeing a lot of vintage stuff. I mean that's that's the whole point of like I said the store and I always said that the motto is that's mm-hmm. why it's called back in time because I want you to feel you know people go in there like, oh you know I've, I've it's been a while since oh I remember when I was a kid I used to play with this and I mean I, I love to hear that because that just pretty much but, uh, even, even if they don't buy it just just give them a, a remembrance of uh, what they you know had in their childhood so but but not not to I not I promise this is not a, a, a commercial or anything like that but I feel like you've been moving more stuff lately I don't know if it's just my impression but. I feel like like you you've been like up, updating and moving and selling a little yes. more. I don't know if it is because of the shows or your stories just been popping up a little bit. I mean, I don't know if it is just my impression or you feel like the same. But yeah, I, honestly, I, I honestly, me personally, I think it's the timing. I know the economy wasn't too good. Remember we talked about yeah, it. So yeah. there's sometimes that it doesn't. Because when I, I remember when I first opened up the store, it, it was like that. I was just moving merch, bringing more merch in, more more you know more stuff in, and um, and it kind of slowed down a little bit. You know took a little little you know cruise uh-huh. and now it's gonna pick back up which is i'm happy for which that, is good you know? yeah, yeah. It, it, for me it's exciting because even though it's not for me i still love hunting yes as you know looking for things and finding things like ooh and an and and i wish i could have it but then you know what <laughs> the, the store needs to get us for the stores not for yeah, me yeah because just... i i have my personal collection and at the end of the day you know i mean i'm not gonna i don't want to be greedy and be like everything's for me and I don't know the store can have yeah, something that. for us, man. Yeah, exactly. So I, I you know, I want to share the wealth and make sure that people. I mean, I, I, like I said, people go in there, man. Your stuff is really clean, you know. It's really, and that's what I say. I want to, I want to sell the best quality that I can. No, absolutely, absolutely. And yeah. again, not because you're here, but yeah, definitely, your store yeah. feel like feel, your store feels clean. Your your stuff, everything that you you put up, to, it's 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 a nice selection too as well. You have yeah. some comics, you have some figures. Trying to have everything for everybody, you know, and and that's the thing that I, I think we talked about it. I did a little show with Macarena, and that's what we talked about is. When I first opened up, I thought, "Oh, I'm a turtle lover, so I know when I you I'm wanted have to put shows, up only what what you like." Yeah, exactly, and that's a lesson learned. <laughs> is I think every city, and me personally, I feel like every city has their niche, and here is more like Transformers. I think I think it's more of an older crowd here in Houston. If you mm. if you ask me, okay. that's what I've noticed. Yeah, you have some people buying some turtles, yeah, but when it comes to like super marvel superpowers things like that people go crazy heavy for hitters transformers. heavy hitters are more like transformers yeah and... things like that so uh like comic palooza people are looking for more transformers older stuff even old school migos um uh migos uh star trek no you know who buys star trek but people people like <laughs> people that people like him yeah so yeah i mean it's it's a uh, it's a uh, good that's why i it opens me up to understand the industry for one but the city that i live in mm-hmm. doesn't mean that i don't sell outside like i said i do ship and that's where I make the bigger sales of like people when people want turtles or something a bigger bigger ticket item. That's fine. I'm more, I'm more than help, happy. That's to, cool. Uh, that's cool. They can ship, cover yeah. a little bit of uh, more than just just the store. Um, yeah, yeah. That's pretty cool, man. That's pretty cool. Mm-hmm. And so I, I guess the topic we're talking about is almost what we're we're saying like shopping yeah, and hunting. Yeah. I was I was I was talking. We were talking earlier, and I was like, um, I had um kind of like a dry season for me <laughs> I'm buying three three weeks. Three weeks. Oh, sh- well, <laughs> tell that to an addict. <laughs> Cesar, are you hearing this? Um, <laughs> no, I, 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 it felt, yeah, I don't no, know if I, it was three weeks. I think it was more, but if if it's not, if it wasn't three weeks, it definitely felt more than three weeks. But I get where you're coming no, from. No, but I, I think it was more than a month uh, that, that I had not buy anything, like literally anything. Okay, what's the last piece you bought? Can you remember? I will have to look back. And was it, was to, it the Goku? It was the Goku. Yes, it was the Goku and box the the Epoch, the big doll. But yes, it was a purchase. But I, before that, I I I I I hadn't purchased anything. But I didn't feel like it was a purchase. I felt I felt like it was a trade, even though it wasn't it wasn't a direct trade. But I sold some figures <laughs> to buy it. That's why I've. But yeah, I, technically, it was a purchase. I but it was more than a like month. The tippy on things. No, 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 no. Yeah, but but given the way that I purchase uh, I, my collection or mm-hmm. I, I acquire my collection is usually by purchase, and that one felt like a trade. Okay. Because yes, I wanted it, and then once I saw it, I put up like some figures that I had for, mm-hmm. for got the money. I purchased it. I I, I feel like I, I didn't 
It felt like a trade to me. It wasn't, but it felt, felt like I a trade. I get what you're saying. But even 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 if you go back to that, it was more than a month. I'm one, I'm sure there was more more than a month. But even before that, I I had stopped. I, like it's just it's been a it was a a long season for me yeah. to to kind of like try to. I don't know if I learned anything. <laughs> I don't think I did, honestly. <laughs> I wish I could come back and say, you know, I recover and all that. But once I broke that, uh, the, 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 the straight, uh, uh-huh. the, 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 the streak right. that I had. Oh man. Oh man. I, I went all, I feel like <laughs> it was a time, but it was, it, it was a perfect storm. That's the problem. It's always like, perfect, right? And we hear that. It, it, that's something we always talk like about. The, like when you try not to, and it's like, man, it always never fails. When, when you're trying not to, but the thing is, like this one, I was like, okay, I'm ready to come out back again to the to the the community, uh huh. To yeah, to, to get some something for the collection, and then like a lot of goodies shows up. Like oh my god, for Dragon Ball figures that I've been looking for. Uh, there's a set of uh, Epoch uh, figures. Uh, mm-hmm. They're on Blizzard. Not 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 the Bulma, but they're like three on Blizzard. They got only Oolong, uh, Goku, and Bulma, I believe. Uh-huh. And right there, the set it was all together. Mm-hmm. And then I was still first in the beginning. I was like, oh no, I'm not gonna buy it. The guy put it up for for a set price. Oh, he had a set price on it. It kind of like a starting price, but it was a good price. Mm-hmm. Nobody bid on it for the for the for the set of three. Nobody bid on it. I was like, I'm I I like, no, cool. I'm I'm not gonna buy it or whatever. A couple of <laughs> days pass, nobody bid on it. The guy breaks up the the set, Uh-oh. put him individuals, but he puts a, a set price. It was a high set price. Nobody bid on him. Hmm. And then when the and this is this is when it comes tricky. And this is what we're gonna talk about about the the the. The the buying online, the auctioning, Auction, the, okay. the effects that it has mm-hmm. on us, and I feel like it was it was one of those effects that were, where once the guy put it the the set separately, mm-hmm. the three of them separately, and it started for a dollar. Oh man, the game the game was yeah, game, like, game oh one, my god, game one, yeah. it's now or never because somebody's gonna bid on it. The other one was like ah maybe nobody bids on it. If somebody bids at the last minute, ah uh, okay I lost it whatever. But it was a, 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 a when when you put a set price, you're like I don't know if I'm leaving something on the and table. We can talk about that because I know exactly what I you're talking about. I don't know if I'm about. leaving something on the table. I'm, I'm not if I'm putting more than, than what I should have. Mm-hmm. Later, on, I I learned like man, I should have gotten the, the set of the three. It was a good price for what they ended up with. Mm-hmm. It was funny because he the guy put them up, nobody bid on them. Once he break them up, they go higher for what he was and asking that's, for. That's, that's, that was, it was crazy and then i was like all right i got the oolong for less than what i thought i was gonna get it perfect but then the goku it went for higher than what i thought about i was gonna get but like i need to get the goku but since i wanted to get the goku and then the bull was getting high i had to <laughs> i had to i had to 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 give up the bull because i want i wanted to, to get the goku is usually mm-hmm. the hardest to get uh any of the three is, is kind of hard so i was like oh man so I ended up getting the Oolong. That, that went for, for cheap. It was good. Mm-hmm. Uh, the Goku went for a little bit higher. But man, oh man, I wish I would have gotten it with, with that. So so let me ask you this. Would it have been better just to get the set then when he first had it? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Maybe some people that might have wanted them didn't buy it because probably they already have one of the three pieces. They only needed one or two, yeah. whatever. That's why they didn't go for the set. Me personally, since I wanted all three and I didn't have any of them, I should have been jumped perfect, it. Yeah. But I was still in that stage where I was like, I need to save up money. I need. I was. Mm-hmm. I felt like it wasn't. I needed a, like literally like like that extra week to kind of like, you know, be done with with pendings that I had. Uh-huh. Besides, it was literally on those days where I like I was like, I couldn't lift my finger. I I, I honestly it was. I want to go back. I, I'm not. I don't want to go back into that. But I'm just. I just want to mention. It was. Yeah. I was so bad in in, in, in health. I didn't have. I, I. I. You just didn't have no energy. I didn't step anything. on the on the cave for like two weeks, man. Like mm. like it was it was bad. I I couldn't even walk. Yeah. I I didn't have the energy to come up here. If I would come up, I w- I was walking on crutches. It was bad. So mm. staying on bed for that long it was just like it was not good. I I saw them, but it didn't it didn't lift my spirit. Yeah. 
So it was a bad combination. Anyways, when they come up, when they come out individually, and they, he, the guy started for a dollar, I was like, oh, man. <laughs> And I feel like, okay, this is a moment to, to break it. Like I start going for the Oolong, like I, they, they might go, and then boom. I got the two, I got the two out of three. I was like, all right, that's good, it's good. And then all of a sudden, same, same I, like, I saw some some samurai pizza cut. I'm like, oh my God. I'm uh. So which samurai pizza cuts are you needing? Because I thought you pretty much had the whole. No, because I, I have the. Oh, the houses, right? No, or? no, no. Well, the houses I still need, but I still need two of the small houses. But they're like the ones that you put together. Okay. The the model kits. Yeah, the model kits. Those are most of the pizza cuts are model kits, right? Mm -hmm. So you have the mega, the mega Yatero, the mega Purun, the mega. So those are the three main characters. Mm -hmm. They're a little bit bigger. So that's one set, the set of three. Mm -hmm. But then you have another set from one to eight. Okay. If I'm not mistaken. That's, that's all the characters, and right? And then though. the one, two, three is the same main three characters. But they're a little bit smaller than mm -hmm. the mega ones. So you, those three. And then the hard ones to get is from four to eight. Okay. Eight being the catatonic, which is the hardest to get. I already had one, but it was already put together. I, did, I didn't get the box. Mm. So now I need from four to seven. And then I found. Four, okay. I needed the three, two. I needed the three. So I only had one and two. So I found I needed it from three to seven, and then I found uh, the guy was putting uh, put up uh, the three, the six, and the seven. Okay. So I got those three. That's it. And then I, I only need four and five. That's it. Hmm. Almost there. Huh? Four and five, and and I, and I'm I feel like I feel like I'll be there with the samurai pizza cats, and if I find the other two, there's like a one big playset. And there's three big places. I already have the big one, mm -hmm. and I have one of the three big small places. If I can buy, if I can find the other two small places, it's gonna be a plus. It's gonna be a win. Oh, yeah. It's gonna be. Yeah. But I'll be content with the with the figures. But but that's a that's a that's a hard. And not a lot of. But not, believe, not, yeah, believe not, it or not, you're saying what you have, what you find it. But and believe it or not, guys, it's hard to find. This it's stuff hard, is to find. hard to find. It, it, yeah. All these are from. From uh, 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 auction house in Japan, mm -hmm. which is Yahoo Auctions. Uh, I use a third party. Mm -hmm. It's called Bai. We'll talk about it. And this is what we wanted to talk about: yeah. uh, uh, auction houses, auction uh, like like eBay, Bai, Whatnot, or even uh, uh, Hakes or Hakes um, or Golden. Golden stuff like that. Uh, or since we're talking about buying online, we can even talk about you know. I mean, they even have live auctions on on Facebook, Facebook groups, stuff like mm -hmm. that. But yeah, um, <coughs> so yeah, I I broke my strike, and, but but then it, that, that's what I'm saying. I don't know if I learned anything from, uh, from <laughs> because I went hard, and then I found a, well, a boom. Uh, but the thing it's, about it's just okay. But the the thing about it is, like, was it really a streak that you were trying? You were trying to. Contain yourself because you had other stuff pending, things that you had to buy. It wasn't like I was yes, just stop buying. but I was trying to honestly. I was trying to kind of like all there's right, no way in hell. learn something. There's no way in hell. Learn Is something. There... Try to to pace no. myself. Mm -mm. Uh, but now once I went by, yeah, there's, there's no way. I saying. feel like I let go, like like a <laughs> like a like a con constricted, contained, yeah, animal, whatever. And then the, They'll but now, the cage. I, yeah. I, I, yeah, I'm like, I'm like, I have to stop. So okay, so now that you broke the streak, how do you feel? Do you feel like you have to keep buying, or you still? I, I was scared because I was like, am I getting used to not buy anything? Because I was like, just looking stuff that I wanted. I was like, ah, oh, no, whatever. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm not buying. I'm not buying. I'm not buying. I was like, am I, am I getting different? Is it just as like, am I or am I being responsible now or what is it? <laughs> I think it was. Am just, I growing up? Am I growing up? <laughs> But uh, but nah, I, I felt good. I felt good. It feels good. You know, that 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 feeling came back. Like it's, it feels good to have a a, a haunt, a thrill to oh, haunt, yeah. and to find those pieces. I feel like I I just look back at the spots that where I want to put them, and I'm already get excited. Like I oh my god, I, I want to get here. Picturing, yeah. So so no, I'm excited. I'm excited. But uh, but yeah, it was, it was a little bit of a back and forth with the with the auctions and all that. And we wanted to talk about about that. Yeah, about you were t you were pretty much when we were talking before the podcast. You were telling me, and it was it was a funny story how the way the see I, I don't know how the the auction for buy works, but you were explaining yes. it to me. But it was funny how you were explaining. Let, let me explain the, a little bit more, right? So so 
I found this, 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 and a lot of people don't want this to be known because it's a, basically it's, <laughs> it's, a, it's a market in Japan and then slowly the American market is getting into this, mm -hmm. into this auctions. Right. So what happens? So with people the, yeah, who knows about it, yeah. they don't want to. It's a little bit harder because you have to technically go and and, and look it up on, on Google Translate, type it to be able to type mm -hmm. it in Japanese, and then go back. And yeah, it's a little bit more tricky, but once you got it down, man. Yeah. Once you, yeah, yeah, yeah. But even even now, I, it's it's hard for me to find stuff there. Like you, you have to really get into the the app mm -hmm. uh basically it's an app it's a third party it's called Bai. uh sorry for everybody that i'm breaking the the, <laughs> the bubble that no but people didn't want me to talk about it but it's called Bai. uh it's a third party that deals with mercury in japan uh, uh yahoo auction mm -hmm. uh regular yahoo just just and another another ones but the main ones is yahoo auctions and, and mercury uh, it's a third party, and then you bid through that third party. You sometimes have some limitations. Sometimes the the sellers yeah. don't want to accept bids from third parties, stuff like that. It's not very common, but but sometimes you, you do mm -hmm. face those those situations. But you definitely open up the market, like the stuff that you will see here in the in the U.S. market for a lot more because of the yeah the the rarity the, of it and mm -hmm. the or just simply the shipping and all simply that. they just don't come up. Like I I. I it takes a while to come up in Bali or, mm -hmm. or like in Japan. Mm -hmm. It's just gonna take forever and longer to, to come up on eBay. And, and, like yeah. eBay is, is and far. honestly, when something rare like that comes out on eBay, people know what it is. That thing is not gonna. It, it's it, gonna it sell gets quick. crazy. Yeah. But but to be honest, sometimes I don't know. I, it's just weird. It's just crazy how it works. Because in Japan, there's a hardcore. There's a really hardcore collection. I'm I'm, I'm thinking it's not only from the U.S. market. But since this third party, they also sell in Europe and like, mm. it's a, yeah. it's, it's becoming a worldwide uh, uh, platform. So stuff that I'm looking for, man, pff, Dragon Ball. And, and it's great. Yeah, it's rare it is, but then you have a lot of competition. You have a lot of competition and then and, and people really, really going crazy. And especially right now for, for the Dragon Ball pieces. Man, that's what I was asking you. So right now, you think Dragon Ball is just going up because of because of the passing away I, of the I, creator? I, I think because yeah, because Akira Toriyama passed away. I think that's that's one big um, reasoning reasoning for for the. So but, so let me, but, okay, well let me ask you this. But but no. I don't know how that can be directly related to the vintage because the vintage is the one that's exploding. But okay, I, I but that, that's what I'm saying. So do you think the market? Is only right now is hyped up because of that, and then eventually it's just gonna come down a little bit. I'm not sure. So I'm you, not sure. So it's people we, are willing to. It, it's weird because we're talking about Dragon Ball. I'm not. I'm not saying that it's in the same level of Pokemon, but it's up there. Like it's a. It's a big franchise, still active. Yeah, but it was almost like what you said. I didn't think that Goku was gonna go for that much. You know, he had a set price. Nobody, nobody put a number on it. No, no, nobody. Even. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that, that's what I'm getting at. Is do you think? And I understand there could be multiple reasons why these nobody put a bid on. Nobody took that took that offer of getting all three of them together. But what I'm saying is because of the creator being you know passing away, that has a lot of reason why. To, and so, so once, once you know his his, his legacy is not going to die. But once you know that. Is that going to bring the market down to back to where it should have been? I think I think in this particular case, it all, it all depends on on. on, on. So I don't know how the how the how the market how the people in in Japan takes it because here, if, like, believe it or not, want it or not, there's a lot of influences uh, from people that were like uh, open collectors, people yeah. that post or. Like the people get to know the pieces that we collect. Mm -hmm. Sometimes we, it's a double sword. Yeah. Double, yeah, I get double, what you're double, double sword because mm -hmm. I want to share it. But then I create my, own, create my own competition. And then if I get, if I get to interest one person into this line, then I, it. then I got, I have got a, a, somebody yeah. else to, to beat on against to. So, so it's a, it's a double edged sword, but, uh, but at the end of the day, I do it because I care. I do it because I want to share it. I I don't care. I mean, but but time, in Japan, yeah. it's crazy. I don't I don't know what Japan is very hardcore with their shows. We're talking about Saint Seiya. We're talking about Dragon Ball. Uh, anything like like 
worldwide that came from Japan. Hello Kitty. This is, oh, yeah. It's crazy. It's crazy how. I it, guess I guess they have a, a you know I, I it's, but I think it's just the uh, their culture. They, I think in in general, just their culture is like that. Everything for them is you know is, is spiritual and things like that. So. I, yeah, I think even and, with that, and, and that's the thing. Sometimes you don't even know who you're bidding against. Maybe maybe you're not bidding against Japanese people. You're probably bidding with against other people in America. As probably well. I, you never know. Or somebody like I that. know, I know. He's just <laughs> putting up for like three thousand dollars. I think I, if he asked me, I think he says yes, it's a close collect. He yeah, don't want to. He he's a collector. Yeah. But he just don't want to tell nobody. He's putting up three thousand dollars <laughs> against me. Um, <laughs> hey, listen, one question. So this this by website, this is a compilation of posts from other websites or do you need to bid through this third party because you're not able to do it on yahoo the, the, the thing is like you have to put a, an address to you you, pr you can probably get, a, get around it if you go straight to, to yahoo auctions but you have to open up an account then you have to put up put up an address most of the sellers from japan they won't ship worldwide they huh. will ship only to, to, to Japan. Within, to, to Japan, Japan, yeah, within, within Japan. Within the States. So order. there's some that it says this can ship directly to like worldwide, but there's very few. And there's some, there's sometimes they're so rare, the figures, that you don't want to risk it. The third party, what it does is like you bid through them, but you don't only bid it through them, but they have an address. They have a warehouse in Japan where the seller ships it at, or believes they're shipping it to the seller, but ships it to the to the buy warehouse where the buy mm -hmm. warehouse contains it for you for, for the first 30 days for free. He has it for you. And then you kind of like, if you buy it within that month, you kind of like get those packages to you, to your account. You put it together. And then once you hit whatever your market that you wanted to put, you you, you, you combine them, you put them together, and then you tell them, all right, ship all these this, this pieces that I have. And they they, they put them on a, on, a, on a box and they ship it to you. And believe it or not, the shipping there is it's not too bad because you get your stuff pretty quick. For everyone coming from Japan, you get some stuff pretty quick. Yeah, they, 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 do, they do. They do ship, ship pretty quick, well, probably within a week. Uh, you can get it for two days. But usually when you do two days, yeah, you, you have to pay the... the the rush fee, the expediting fee, and all the, that, and uh, the, the, the 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 export fees or exports, imports, something like that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. La aduana. I don't know how to say that aduana. La, la, the the customs. The customs. Okay. Yeah. The, you 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 have to pay. Usually, uh, UPS gets the package here, and then like, oh, they collect the the check yeah. here in the in, in your, and then. But if you wait for a week, we can some. It's, you it's, to, yeah. You don't have to pay. But uh, but yeah, it's 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 a it's a it's a it's a nice. But uh, yeah, so so I'm I'm used to, of course, I'm I'm more used to using uh, eBay. eBay. And I know what not when you explain to me how the way buy -E works, I like it's almost like one out. So it's pretty much when you bid, and somebody else bids against you, the clock goes up resets. a couple of seconds. Yeah, it resets to a couple of oh, seconds. One, I don't want one. Yeah. But in buy, you said it resets after. Since it's, 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 it's not like and one, that's one, of, it, one yeah. of law goes live for, yeah. for the for 40 seconds auctions, right? So this one takes, you know, something six days, three mm -hmm. days, a couple of days, depending on the seller. But what it does is the last the last bids, you can bid. It's not like 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 eBay. eBay you bid, you bid, you the bid clock. in the last second and the clock runs yeah, out and runs then out. whoever gets a higher bid, that's it. Mm -hmm. And this one's not, like this one, if you bid past like five seconds, like in the last five, oh, sorry, five, 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 five minutes, minutes yeah. the clock resets to, to 10 minutes. It resets five, uh, like another five to, minutes, to 10 yeah. minutes and then gives the other guy a chance an to opportunity think like, it. hey, somebody I'll bid you and then it gives you time. I'm like that's what I don't like. <laughs> so, so yeah, yeah, the trick is But but the thing about the it the trick like, is to bid like right, right around the minute that set the, the 7 minute or the 6 minute. That way the the, the clock doesn't the, reset. Doesn't reset. Kind of like yeah. Uh kick, kick is going, but it's something still resets. It's it just weird like it's just Yeah, that's, that's I mean I never I, I didn't know that auction worked. I wonder because I, I, I never really bought anything from Hakes or from Golden so I wouldn't I wonder if they do the same. I doubt they would do the same thing. They just, I, I, for what I've seen, I've never bid on Golden, but uh, I've seen the the the, the show on eBay mm -hmm. and they sometimes put up. And now they have a a, a dead limit, like a. So the time runs out. And what I've seen is like they don't put up like Buy or like or eBay, where you put a max bid and they just all bid for a couple of dollars the last bidder. 
Mm-hmm. What I've seen on 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 the show, I've never been on on Golden, but what I've seen is, you put a uh, four hundred dollars, and the other guy for puts six hundred dollars. Mm-hmm. The next bit is six hundred dollars. Like it, it, I get what it, you're it's saying, not yeah. just I'll bid you for a little bit. It's just gonna go for the for the mm-hmm. max bid that you have. So, but yeah, yeah, eBay, eBay, eBay has its tricks too. Mm-hmm. Uh, the one the one that I like to do is like I don't like to to bid during the days of the auction because i feel like you're just ramping up and you're just hyping up and you're just putting up too much mm-hmm. you, you're basically showing your cards that you want it so what i yeah, do is a little bit mysterious about it yeah no what i do on ebay and people say oh you 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 bid you want it or you you bid me up for three for three dollars no i didn't it was it was the app yeah. right so if you put 350 and mm-hmm. my max bid was six hundred. I put six hundred, but the app is gonna, gonna bid you. If yeah. you put three fifty, it's gonna put three fifty five. But my max bid it was six hundred. And, and so that's that's what we talk about at times. There's times that we looked at the auction. We, we look at a piece and we both like, how much did it go for? And we said it went for fifteen hundred bucks. Okay, but did it really go for that? I wonder if the next guy that would have bid would have been fifteen hundred. Would have been. What if he put a max bid of two thousand? Yes. So, so we don't know if it actually went, you know. If, if there was something yeah. left on the table yeah, to, for, exactly. for, to some collect. People, some people, I've, I've heard this so many times, oh, man, I lost it for 35 cents or I lost it for a dollar. Like, did you really? Because what if you put that extra dollar and his actual max bid was. Yes. Yeah, no, so. uh, some people kind of like hit, hit like, oh, like kind of like lashes, like hit themselves. Oh, my God, I lost it. And they go on, 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 on Facebook or whatever. Oh, I lost last second for a dollar. How dare like no, you didn't lose for a dollar. Like Well, we don't probably, know that. That's the thing. We yeah, don't, we but don't mo- know. most likely not. Probably like the guy put up like ten, fifty, twenty, a hundred dollars more than mm-hmm. you. So I have done something that's crazy, man. I something's gone crazy, like where I do not want to miss this. And, and I've put ridiculous figures <laughs> just to not lose something. I mean, thank God for the for the for the for the <laughs> out of bidding uh-huh. and not my max bid, right? So, because I put for like I remember when I was hunting for the for the black belt Ralph accessories, I was like, I'm not gonna let this go, and and it was a I think I put up like five hundred dollars or four hundred dollars, something ridiculous for an accessory, mm-hmm. and he went for one hundred seventy five, one hundred fifty. I was like, it was it was reasonable, but I was like, there's no way that somebody's gonna beat me. I want it now. It was, I mean, that's it, it and, and that's yeah, that's the rush. But imagine if there's another crazy guy that like oh, and, I, and then it puts like three hundred to fifty, thinking that nobody else is gonna do that. I don't think there's anybody crazier than you. Oh my! Well, I've seen I've seen you. I've seen you be. <laughs> come on, come on! So, I've seen you be. So let, let, let me ask you this. Let me ask you something. When you're bidding, and you like the seconds are, are winding down, does your heart start beating? I've, I think it. I think it does, but the, the way that you, I that, think it does, but the way that you describe it, I, I think to me it you, does. I'm telling you, it does. Like, especially if it's the piece but, that but you it, really want. But he's not a junkie, guys. He's not a junkie. He's not. He's not addicted. All right. I, I, continue. I never, continue. I never, I never said that. I never disagreed <laughs> to that. Um, but I was like, yeah, I mean, that always happens when it's a piece that I really, really, really want bad, and I like, man, you said the same. You hit it. You know, the, the nail on the coffin is. I'm not going to let nobody beat me on this one. So I'm going to have to put a high number, a ridiculous number where I know, like, I just hope nobody is in that same. Nobody's as ridiculous it, as me. Yeah. That's <laughs> like, oh, man. And, and, be- and usually, it's, thank, you know, thank thank God that I don't want to say like that, but, you know, uh, that I've, I've won. But sometimes, man, I actually overpay. Like, man, I overpaid for this piece. But I'm like, man, you know what? I feel like, yeah, one of my friends told me, like, oh, how does it feel to pay? Because I feel like I paid a little bit more for that. Uh, Besides those those two figures that I was telling about, then they, then later on I bought a a bull myself as part of a set of five, mm-hmm. also Dragon Ball Epic and all that, and I was thinking that bull was gonna go for like around six hundred, seven hundred. <laughs> he went for higher. He went for higher <laughs> than that. I put up my max bid at eight hundred, and then that freaking clock. This is what I what I don't like about buy, because that that clock resets. And my max and on eBay, my max bid would have been eight hundred, and that's it. And if I lost it, I lost it. Mm-hmm. But a buy <laughs> resets the clock, and then lets the other guy, and then and then puts eight 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 oh five or eight fifteen. Like I'm not gonna let it go for fifteen dollars. Yeah, exactly. And then it gives you time to think, but it's not a it's not a good thinking. So I went up and I went up and I went up and I went up. Anyways, it went higher than what I wanted. <laughs> and our friend told me, like, hey, how does it feel to pay more? Like, just, it was teasing me, teasing with me, right? Mm-hmm. 
oh, how does it feel to pay more than what you wanted or whatever? And, and I was like, honestly, honestly, after I, I click pay, whatever, it just it just goes away. I just matter. want my figure yeah, now. Exactly. I just want my figure now. I think, I think, it I, shouldn't it, be like that. It, it, a lot of people was going to criticize. I was like, mm -hmm. sometimes for... for I don't think it's overpaying because I feel so, like okay. the figure is rare. I, I know I know this is not the topic, but let me let me ask you this. So what if what if we're the ones that are hyping the market up? And we're not doing it because we're doing it intentionally, but because we really want the piece of so people. We're start, gonna stop doing the podcast. We're gonna start like spill, <laughs> spilling the beans. <laughs> but you get what I'm saying? So like, like the Velma. The Boomer. You uh you okay, this was your max bid. You thought it was gonna go for this much and you 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 paid more than what you expected, and probably everybody thought the same thing, like, man, it, it went for that high. So what if the next person says, you know, oh, well, for this high, I'm going to put mine out for this much now. And so now the market is going to be, and that, 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 I think that, that, that happens ha a lot. That happens yeah. a lot. That's, that's, mm -hmm. And that's what I was saying. You put a, you put a, you put a, um, a, 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 a precedent. Mm -hmm. You put a precedent on that figure. Uh, thank God. Or I don't know how I have a figure that out on Bayi. I don't know how to find the sole listings like I do for, for like you do for, mm -hmm. for, for, for eBay. But even you, you leave a reference, you leave a, a okay, a, 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 a precedent of, of how much the figure went for. And, and it's funny because I on, on, on buy at least I don't know I don't know how to do that. But but you do you do have that, that and option, now that figure payment. is gonna go for this much, it's gonna go for this much. And, and it's just I, you never know. But you never it's, know. It's, it's funny whenever like at the store and us and we do this too. I mean it, it seems like it's a norm. It's a norm thing to do now. Look at look it up on eBay. Yeah, you know, on salt, salt exactly. listings. Yeah. Much, so that's the way that you price and, it. And honestly, I think that's how people determine if they're gonna get it or not. I I sold. Remember, I sold the Sentinel this this weekend, mm -hmm. and the guy looked at it. He, he's like, "How much?" I like, gave him a price. He's like, "Okay." He was like thinking about it. He goes, "Let me think about it." He walked around, and he came back maybe like ten minutes later. Cause you know what? I think I'll take it. He probably went up, looked for the eBay. Exactly, and, 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 and I wasn't, I wasn't too far off. But like I said, you thinking about the shipping, you think about shipping, it, and all the that, taxes, you know, yeah, 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 exactly. So no, like, at the end of the day, sometimes it just benefits if you have it there, and that's the way I see it. Sometimes to think, I mean, about, yeah. to think that I sold that same sandal for half a price. Anyways, <laughs> I thought you gave it away. Uh, almost, almost. It was kind of like almost, yeah. And so, and so, yeah. I mean, I mean, it's it's one of those things where. It's just funny how it's it's something normal now. And yeah, I, you have, yeah, and I remember you were called, people say people who say that no, eBay don't matter. People, it, people it's it's a fool. It. It's a fool. Like at least people, at least in America, at least in US, people, people follow people that, look man. up for 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 buy for for eBay prices for even sold listings mm -hmm. or even just just. I, so, I honestly, some people don't even care about the sold listing. They look for the for how much can I get it now, and if it's gonna be cheaper for if like if yeah. I want it now. Where can I buy it? Here. Yeah, and, and so, I mean, but it also, like I said, so you can't just go based, I mean, I'm going to say 95% of the time you go based off of the sole listings, but then you talk about condition. And then you also talk about how many more are out. Okay, this one's sold, but do you see any more in the eBay? No, but th there's, also and, times, and so, there's also times where you want the figure now. Yeah. That's, that's what I'm saying. And, so, and if you have it in front of you, and then, which are, I know there's sole listings, but these are my options to buy it now. Yes, exactly. But, and that's what I'm saying. So if people think that all, all we're saying is the soul listing is what drives, like, no, it doesn't. It's not. Because we're giving you other other reasons. Well, people people are not, people are will go off the soul listing, but they're also going to go based off the condition. They're going to go based off of they want the figure now. Mm -hmm. They go based off, okay, this one's sold, but do you see another one available? Let's say, for instance, there was a, 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 a Goku on eBay, and you haven't seen one in five, six months, and one pops out, it sells, okay, you're not gonna. What if you don't see another one for another six, five, five to six months? So that's that's what I'm saying is, people go based off of that too. People, I mean, I look at it in that sort of aspect is I I look at the sold listings, but that's if I see a multiple ones on for, you know on eBay and I look at the condition of course too. Yeah. That's, that's what I go based off of course the mm -hmm. condition. So condition is everything. Some people try to sell the so uh, sold listing. In worst condition, and they still try to sell it for the That's same right. price. And no, yeah, it is gonna depend on 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 the on the on the criteria of the exactly. seller of the buyer. Yeah. But yeah, no, let, let, talk about uh, talk about you know the the on, on, on other things that that I feel like like the 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 benefits of 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 
shopping online, hunting online. I will say uh, one time I heard a guy like, no, it's more like fishing. And I don't think it's that far off. Like when you talk about haunting toys, yes, you go out there, you haunt, you go to the, to, mm -hmm. the, to, the, to the stores, to the shows, to the garage shows. That's kind of haunting. And, and I like the reference when you when you talk about eBay or something. Like, it's like more like fishing. Like, you're right. You put you set up your your, your searches. Mm -hmm. You cannot wait in for for the to you pop off, and yeah. then you reel it. You, mm -hmm. you, you you send an offer. I feel like yeah, it, it, will, it will be more like fishing, toy fishing. Uh, but but I feel like this it's, it's a lot. It's a lot. You don't. Know, it expands things that you won't find on your local stores on your local. A lot of people say hey, you'll find everything. Like no, it's, it's you'll find it. I mean, but but, but it's not they're not 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 everything. Not everything, especially if you're getting to the rare stuff. But you you just, need those platforms that like people believe, like it or not. It depends on. on and we were talking about last time, like about levels or whatever, but but levels of rarity. Let's mm -hmm. let's, let's be clear. There there there's there is levels of rarity. Level yeah. rarity. All right, yes. so oh, we're yeah. talking about levels of levels of rarity. You have to get into to these platforms if you really want to move forward mm -hmm. into with your collection. Yep, I agree. With that. The, 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 there's no other way. Like otherwise, you'll be traveling. The, I mean, the, it's it's like we talk about finding a needle in a haystack. If somebody you're gonna pay the fee, but you, you will be able to 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 expand and then. You say the seller pays the fee, but at the end of the day, you're paying the fee, yeah, right? Yeah. So, and, and it, this is not to knock on anybody that likes hunting. It's, it's a, it's I wouldn't, a, I wouldn't want us to be the reason why we're trying to make you lose passion of oh, you won't find a rare piece. It could be a possibility that there might be one out of ten in a lifetime that you might find a piece, but it, it's, it's going to be even, very, very hard. Let's say I wanted to get, to put together this collection of muscle months. You th like, There's no way now without without eBay. Without mm -mm. how, exactly where? But what uh, well, I'm talking about just one piece. Uh, if you're talking but about it, a collection, but, but, regard, but still, regardless, still, yeah. still one piece on on this like. But where? I just don't want. I just want the. I don't want the people to feel like it's not worth you hunting for a rare piece. Oh, you can still no, find no, some no, rare no, pieces. No, 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 But here but there, sometimes that's what I'm getting at. Is you can still find some rare pieces uh, uh, when you're hunting. That it happens. And, and I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm looking after it though. You know, I would love to. To you always gonna get. Premium when you're when you're buying online, that's for sure. You're, yeah. paying, you're paying premium, so you can be a little bit patient. You can taste the waters, mm -hmm. give it a year, see how see I, how I mean, much so, it pops so, up. So let me ask you this: with the with the well, what happened with but the both of us when we experienced it when these when that man walked when that guy walked in Ivan he walked in with his uh with those the, with the Star Wars yeah the, 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 I mean when do you see something like that happen and that's what i'm getting at so that, that's what i'm saying that it, it's gonna happen from time to time i'm not gonna say it all the time but when we're talking about if you actually want to get into tiers of rarity and collecting you have to i mean i i don't see no other way just like you said you have to be on the on online shopping and, and we're not just talking about ebay i mean you facebook because you have you might have you might know somebody that knows somebody that knows somebody you yes. have to go through facebook mm -hmm. Instagram, uh, what, 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 whatever Why platform, not? but yeah, whatnot, uh, Macari, eBay, Macari, yeah, there's, there's, I mean, there's, sometimes you find some good deals, you accessories for undercovers for 200, 250 bucks, who, who finds yeah. them? Yeah, like, so you find things like that. I mean, there's, there's stuff that, you know, rare, rare things, you, you know, everybody dreams about that, that big find. You know, it's yeah. hard, it's hard to get. It's, it's but but hopefully one day I can get one of those. But I, I got one. You got one. My battle cat. The battle cat, and that was haunted. That was not even online. Th that's what I'm saying. And you know, like you trick a guy, but that's fine. <laughs> you trick a friend of yours, but that's okay. That's good. <laughs> no, I was just kidding. I was just yeah, kidding. Yeah. So um, but yeah, I mean that's that's what I'm telling you. Things like that pop up from time to time, and it's gonna. That's why I don't I don't want the people to feel like you need to go to eBay. We don't have no others response for you just go to ebay no it's, there's some stuff out there there's some rarity things that you could find but yeah when, you, when you're talking about a collection of money you know there's <laughs> no way let me let me ask you guys something um do you think it has a merit to find good deals it has a merit that two two people um want one piece both of them got it but one has a better deal does it, that you're does it have a gonna merit brag. in this in this community this, this you're always gonna brag but because it, it, it matters yeah it does it does it does to the to the it depends, right? So if, if you have a lot of money and you don't care and you don't give a shit, yeah, whatever, that's fine. But most of the times it matters. Even if you have a lot of money, 
it's it's more like um it's a bragging <sighs> right it's a bragging right because <laughs> in the community even though you don't want to say it like that even though you don't want to do it like that even though you don't want to say it like that it's a little bit about whoever if, if you're an open collector you're showing your collection you're showing your figures and all that the next level if you if you get a friendship with where you get to share the prizes and all that and i do a lot of this with saludos jose i hate you and i love you but jose always like oh yeah i got this one for this one i like shut up man shut up let me enjoy my figure because he's been on the on, on the toy hunt for dragon ball for way way longer for years and i just started with like i've been if i've been uh, I've been hunting for three years, collecting for three years. Dragon Ball has been for the past six months, or mm-hmm. like it is is more more recent, right? So he's been in the Dragon Ball for years, and, and these particular lines, which is wasn't very popular. So things that are popping out for eight hundred, nine hundred, he was like, oh, I got it for for a hundred. I got mm-hmm. it for like the Funky Pets. Oh, I paid thirty dollars. I paid fifty dollars for those. Like you know, you, you he was know. paying like super cheap. So. Yes, it's a bragging price. Like it's a bragging right that you get when you when you get a, a figure. For, then then he sells them. So I, I think I think that doesn't even matter because he sold them for cheap as well. So, yeah. it, but 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 he still gives me yeah, well, a hard I mean, time. That, exactly. So, salute to the guys that were collecting way before. Uh, you know who's a perfect Andres. 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 Shout has, out to Toy uh, Tommy. Yeah, Toy Tommy. Andres. Andres has some crazy stuff. But man, he paid. Those crazy prices, and when I say crazy, low prices back in the day. So the day. he has some, he has some nice pieces, and he, he people are smart enough to hold on to it. And you know, now, now they have. I think, I think for mm-hmm. everybody that the, the time is is the right time. It, it was if it wasn't your time, it wasn't your time, and you cannot do anything about it. Mm-hmm. But that's one of the things that I, that I wish I could, you know, could have experienced. That's something that I will never get out of out of this hobby. That ex- that maybe in the future, if this doubles up or goes south, well, I don't know what's happening, but I'm gonna be able to say, okay, so in ten years, like, oh, I remember ten years ago. Then basically, I'm building up my experience. But one thing that I will never get to is those, even five years before I started, five years before the pandemic, five years, yeah, like it was, it was a like it was a boom of 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 collectibles it was crazy after the pandemic yeah just around uh, that. Uh, uh, that's right when i started i wish i would have been there at least two years i'm not asking for too much like <laughs> two years before but it wasn't the right time for me i didn't have the space for it i didn't have the i, I, I don't think it would have happened anyways but 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 anyways that's one thing that i wish i, I'm, I just derailed a little bit but but <laughs> if 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 there are two collectors that they both have the same uh, the same collection, but one There's of no them way. one of them has better deals, but the other one took dw- uh, twice the, the the time. Which one has more merit, or it doesn't matter? Bec- they both they, bo- they both have the same the, the same pieces, the same uh, degree. No, of, of, I I, th- of I think I think it's just the way that you see your own collection. I think if, if you're gonna go. If you're gonna go greedy or like the, the the you're trying to 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 kick dust, I think the guy to, that paid less, and that's what a lot of people not hate but yeah, cr- I, criticize I, about me. I, I I think that's like it is. It, it, like how much they, they don't like they, they don't like it because whether I'm paying too much or, 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 or I'm going too fast, <coughs> and I feel like they kind of like don't like the fact that I'm they've been doing it for ten years. And then I doubled up the collection in, in two years. Not bragging, I promise you. It's not a bragging. It's just the way that I collect, the way that I, is my pace, and whatever my opportunities. But some people don't like it, and I, I I can explain. I cannot explain why. But the bragging is oh, but but you pay too much. That's the bragging. That's that's what they. they I, I don't some, care. They have to have a reasoning for for them to for them have, to hate. I, I to or, have a reason to to not agree with something in your collection. Something so, in the collection, even so, most most of the I don't know if if, if 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 it is better or not or, but but most of the time what they will agree, well they will just it's just oh but you pay too much that's kind of like the bragging or oh, you rush into it if if it affects you then it's valid but to me I don't care yeah if if you ask me uh, one year ago which one has merit I would say of course the person that that got the better deals but now it's like they both ha- they both both of them have it. 
and both of them I, I guess enjoy it the same they, they both enjoy their the, the, the journey and now my question is it, it doesn't matter both of them have the collection but and, and you, a year you, ago uh, my, my, my answer would have been the guy who got more deals but but you're right like it's, mm -hmm. it's just it, it's it's just the perspective changes yes but definitely it's just the way that you see it like if you're if you're here for the for the thrill then it doesn't matter how much you pay and then you got it at all if you're here for the deals for the for the for the money for investing for thinking that you're going to sell this off and this is going to be your 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 your, your retirement or whatever then you probably want to look for the prices but honestly if you're looking for the price for 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 this to be a real retirement i feel like you're you're leaving it to 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 more of a i don't know I don't want to. I don't want to dis disregard people who who yeah. I mean, who think of, of it as an investment. It's because there is a lot of people that think about it. But honestly, we talked about it, and I, I I kind of feel strong about that. I mean, we talked about it before about toy lines going down, you know, dying mm -hmm. out, and it's gonna happen. And 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 you know, I guess people that are looking at it like this is a big nest egg. You know, we we're gonna we're gonna. I mean, I know later on when I retire, I'm gonna use this money as as an and man, what if. What if it's not worth what it was, you know? And uh, we, you know, it's not to scare uh, uh, people, but I really, I really feel strongly about that. If, if you don't, yeah, like that's what I'm saying. Like, try not to think about it as an investment. Enjoy it. Mm -hmm. If you wanna get money out of it, it's funny because you wanna enjoy it while it's popular. Mm -hmm. But then that's the best moment to sell it because while it's popular. Yeah. But you wanna have it while it's popular, and then you wanna sell it whenever you're fit when you're done with it. But then maybe a lot of people might so be done that, with it. So well. that's something that's why it's it's. I'm not saying it's good, but then that's why there's people that want the piece so much, so bad, they get it, and as soon as they hold it for two weeks or a week, they sell it off and be like, okay, well, I already at least I owned it. I owned it. I, I, I took a picture it. with it. Yeah, I, I sold it. I sold it. I, I, to me, it's, that yeah, happens. Mm. That happens yeah. a lot. A lot of people, people lot just people like wants to, to two to weeks. Hold. It, it could, I'm, I'm just using, but yeah, it could be a week, two weeks, it could be a month. I mean. It, it, they, I for mean, people, for people, for us, like us, that we buy to hold, mm -hmm. it just two weeks, even a month, even three months seems like, why would you buy it? Like, yeah, well, what, what's the point of you? What's even, the point? But well, for them, it's, bad, but it's a different thrill. They, they have it. They, they the can hunt, sell. They got it. They got it. They own it. And they sell it. They probably make profit. That's good. Move on. I cannot think about it like that. Like, I, this is no way. Things that, honestly, the ones that I've sold. It's just literally because I have duplicates, and then I can I had to make my piece, and it's I, it exactly, took me, it yeah. took me a while to make my piece, even though I had a double. But okay, I, I, but for me to sell a, a, a something that I don't have double, it's like pulling it's teeth hard, out. Like, it's like pulling teeth out. I mean, yeah, you don't want to. Yeah, wanna, yeah I mean, it is. It is because I mean, there's times that people come on set it and like, man, I I can't. I'll give you this, but no, but I just can't. It has to be a ridiculous number, like yeah. you said. Everything has a price. Whoever says that that is not for sale. I mean, the only one person I did agree with was Macarena because remember we talked about that and she said, you know, something yes. like, that's, that's, under, that's something understandable. Like too There's, much of a sentimental, sentimental yeah, value. But, that's understandable. But even though I say I don't, I won't sell the Sam. Somebody tells you here's 50,000 for 50,000. I'll wrap it up for you. Uh, <laughs> thank you. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll fly whatever you are. Uh, yeah. I'll deliver it personally. Yeah. Like, yes. I, it's not, it's worth, it's, it's worth that much. No, it's not. But yeah. when people ask me, if you're like, no, because I'm not gonna be the 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 idiot that, because people keep asking me, and there's a guy, Carlos. <laughs> I don't know if he sees me. His name is Carlos. I think it's Carlos. Uh, I like his name. Every every other, I don't know, three or four days. Hey brother, how you doing? Good. You ready to sell the same? Like no. I like no. his name and I like his passion. <laughs> yes. <laughs> But to be honest, like, and, and I, one time, like, I, one time I asked him and he didn't reply. Maybe, maybe we got the conversation mixed up, but we were talking about several stuff at the same time. And then I throw that, like, well, how much would you consider? Like how much, like, maybe I'm saying no to a ridiculous figure, mm -hmm. but he didn't reply. Maybe, maybe he did. He just, we were He's talking like, about, Ooh, nice. uh -huh. we were talking about different stuff, but, but, but. But what if he throws a fifty thousand like stuff like that? Like, wait, wait, wait come on! I, I did. I've, <laughs> yeah, I was stupid of me, you know. Yeah, I, I could make up a, like a lot of a lot of the collection with that. I don't think this is ever gonna happen. No, but I mean, regardless, but you know, everything yeah. has a price for sure. Like, 
unless, like you said, super sentimental value. And, and I've been watching the the. I don't know if you guys are watching the 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 show on Netflix, the Golden, oh. the, the King of Collectibles. I've, I'm on the second. I'm on. I'm 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 halfway the third episode. And yeah, there's a guy that has like a super rare, mega freaking rare, more than more rare than the the Ricky Mantle. Mickey Mantle, yeah. Mickey Mantle, whatever. Yeah, uh, there was one even more rare that just only came on the t tobacco uh -huh. cigarette, whatever. It was a super mega rare, and says it is worth I don't know, twenty, forty thousand dollars, crazy number. No, something like that. I don't even remember. I think uh, we we watch it. You see how much uh, that Michael Jordan car went for the uh, uh, like almost three million. Yeah, so it, it's it gets crazy, but the guy like no, this is once like this is all the only one in the world. Blah 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 blah. But then they like would you say like well for this much like yeah. everything has a price yeah. like it'll be too 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 dumb too stupid. Yes, yeah, some some I mean some people like we said that they hold on to it. But they hold on to it because they think, well, the longer I wait, the more money I'm going to get. And that's not a for sometimes, sure thing. Sometimes it's not. Sometimes but that's what I say. That's not a for sure thing. So that's why me personally, I don't think that way. If if I'm going to sell, like you said, I will sell like now. But at the same time, I wouldn't want to feel like, man, 10 years from now, like, you know, I'm going to put my foot in my mouth and be like, I said, I said, it should be worth it. Everything can go. Yeah, everything yeah. can go. So you just don't or, know. Yeah, you don't know. Because what if. What if something happened? Like nobody, like even though as much as I can, I want to push it. Whatever the the, brand. the muscle mods, mm -hmm. nobody knows. Like and whoever knows about it, they just go on eBay. There's very few pieces. They're super expensive. They disregard the line. They just it's a line that oh somebody heard about it. Da, 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 mm -hmm. But imagine something comes up about the line. The the a guy that knew what happened comes up in a story. Comes up, in a, there's a big news about it. Something that brings the attention, and then all imagine all of a sudden it becomes like I don't think it's gonna happen, but something yeah, pops yeah, up, okay, yeah. and then gives Make it, makes it relevant. Makes it relevant. Yep. It just you know, and that's what we talked about. That, right, that's, right. that's the thing. Like you right. never know if it's gonna go as, as right we, or wrong. As we said, left or right. Star Wars, Turtles. He man, you can't say he man because they still come out with some stuff here and there. Those are staying relevant. Those lines are staying relevant. Transformers are staying relevant with movies. Mm -hmm. uh, Ghostbusters. But this, I mean, I, and, and so if you keep there's rarity into the rarity of collecting because mm -hmm. you never know. But at the same time, you can say those are relevant. But then the muscle mods, they have They never were. They they were yeah. never relevant. And Why are they so freaking expensive? And, and, but the thing they about they were it, never like there was no show. There was they were never popular on shelves. But what's crazy? People and people go crazy for them. People, uh, yes. People go crazy. People, for them. me <laughs> and more people. Yeah, it's a, it's a small niche. Yeah. But but people who collect them, like you know, they, they will they will yes. go, you know. And then there's people that are looking for 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 cheap peas and all that, and they will still. You know, they're still popular. I seen I seen broken ones still for over five hundred bucks, and they're broken. Like yeah, but I mean, and then I've seen YouTubers moving them, like they're, they're talking about them. Mm -hmm. And then the more you talk about it, the more like mm, yeah. it just. But imagine something pops up, like a guy, like a designer, or something. Something like all of a sudden comes up. Mm -hmm. You never know where the line's gonna go. Yeah. So I'm hoping I'm pushing for the for the muscle mods to hey here he, here he goes he's, he's in the platform guys he's yes. in the platform yes absolutely <laughs> and I will, hey it's been on my thumbnail since day one yeah no, so yeah. I, it's it's a dear line it's a dear I, and dear. I, I actually learned from him about you know I learned from you about them so I mean I, I think they're cool I mean when I first seen like man that thing's pretty cool I've never seen those before those are pretty figures if you if you if you, yeah they, I know awesome. I know they're expensive uh, I, I would recommend to get it into it to to everybody. Not because I don't think you have the money. It's just, it's just really expensive. Well, the thing about it, the line isn't big, but man, oh man, how hard it is to find just the cats hard, yeah, or Sam. And, and let, let let me find the cats, and then I will recommend everybody to get into it. <laughs> but don't get me don't get me any competition right now. I'm trying to find those freaking cats, but I, I know it's gonna be a shot in the freaking dark. And yeah, like the fact that I have the Sam. That puts me. I don't want to brag, but that puts me up there with. Yeah, I mean, no, it does. It does. Like I said, no, nobody. I, I'm, I'm telling you, I know I'm one. I seen one a while back. I didn't know what the hell it was. So I just didn't jump on it. I still doubt. I still. I'm still doubting you. 
I mean, I remember what it was. It had this figure face. That's what that's what I remember about. It. And the guy said, "This is a really rare piece," but people didn't really know what it was. Oh man! And I, I'm telling you that I I remember that clearly. So I was like, okay, but I just didn't know what it was, and that's. But there's only two figures, two two Sams. I've I've only heard about two three cats mm-hmm. being out there. I don't know what happened. Even the we were talking about earlier about about the the, the hand pu- puppets. Yeah, the puppets. I'm not sure, but I feel like those hand puppets that I have, even though nobody nobody knows them, not like very few people know about those hand puppets. Yeah. And for what I've seen out there, they seem that they produce them the same amount as the cats, and as the SM. You know, like the, the, mm-hmm. it seems like they they produce like I don't know five ten. I think pieces. I think a lot of this these well not dogs but the actual like the bad guys and the puppies. I think those are like more production, just production runs, nothing uh, mass produced. No, no, no. It was just kind of like a a, a, a product, like a test, like yeah, four, five, ten pieces. I don't know, maybe twenty. Then the only yeah. a few survived. But the hand puppets that I have, I have two hand puppets, and I feel like I don't give them enough credit. I think those are freaking yeah, rare. Out, out, out there, like on the ready with with the with the with the bad guys. But anyways, yeah, we didn't talk about much about Wana, but Wana is always also been a, a super uh, good uh, source. Source. I feel like it depends on on the sellers. It depends like. It's nice, but so so it was nice for me because when I was looking for 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 turtles and stuff for like turtles, that. For turtles, for smaller pieces, and 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 but one it became like one 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 once my 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 search become became more like smaller, thrill, yeah. more like niche. Mm-hmm. Uh, nothing against one nut is super great. I'm just talking a personal standpoint where I'm at mm-hmm. right now. What I'm looking for, I won't find any Dragon Ball. I won't find any. Pizza cats, I won't find any saints here. Yeah. I won't find any grails that I'm looking for. So I'm like, it, it just became a little bit boring for me to mm-hmm. to to go through the through the streams, spend an hour and then not buy anything. Just kind of like became like a little bit more. So I, I I've been staying away from one nut, uh, even though I'm I've jumped in there here and there. Mm-hmm. But I know you're a seller. How's yeah, and that's what I say from my experience. I mean. This is exactly what you said about like the buy thing, uh, as in people put a set price and it happens on one night. People put a set price. There's times I've done it before too. And sometimes nobody bites on it, but then you put a dollar and guess what? It goes higher. For it, goes, which, it goes higher yeah. than the set price. And and so I, I learned that. So shout out to 4QM, uh, Gino, yeah, SC yeah. Toy Hunter. Four quarter star. Yeah, four quarter mafia. Um, Well, he actually... I, I'm not gonna say he, you know, he was the first one, but he probably was in the whatnot community to start things at a dollar. He started everything. He starts, he starts everything at a dollar. There's nothing he doesn't start at a dollar, and sometimes he has some killer pieces. And that's what I'm saying. I go, to, I definitely have to go to his show because there's killer pieces he finds, and I could. There's times that I actually keep. I'm not gonna lie, but then there's stuff that I sell at the store because you know, these are these are items that are not found here in Texas, and he's in California, you know. So yeah, all kinds of things. But that's where I learned is when he starts things at a dollar, man, he, you know, it's, he you has a go. better chance. Yeah. There's, there's things that I've seen that, I mean, I know the market and, and I might, he, he might lose in a few, but he's going to win in a lot. Yeah, exactly. And so I start, that's how I learned. And I, you know what? I'm going to start things at a dollar too. And let me just see how it goes. And there's been times that I actually tested both, both sides is I want $30 for this piece. Let me for just $30. And, Nobody bites. Then I put it for one dollar, and here you have two guys fighting, and it goes for fifty dollars. I'm like, what? Makes, yes, it's a psyche thing. I don't, I don't, it's a psyche because once you put a set price as a buyer, you feel like, hmm, what if anybody else is wanted to be yeah. on it? What if I'm leaving money on the table? What if I could have gotten for twenty five or twenty dollars? But once it starts for a dollar, and you want the figure, and then the, it turns out there's another guy that wants it. Mm-hmm. It's the thrill of like. Oh man, this is in a good condition. I can get it now. I already paid for another figure, so I'll I'll get the shipping the cheaper. Shipping cheaper, yeah. I'll let, let, me, let me just get it. Let me just get it. And then it just goes for for much higher. It happened to me with those pieces on, on Dragon Ball. Exactly. I could have gotten the the set of the three. Seat, yeah. And all almost almost spent, if not, kind of like spend the same for two pieces. And mm. then I could have got it for the all oh, oh, like Boku, a, yeah. almost almost, but but definitely split. The guy got more money than what he had set for. 
And so and so yeah, that, that's that's where that's where we're going back to all the psyche thing as well when you go to auctions, live auctions. I mean there's times that sometimes people put something up and nobody bites and then there's been times that I ask, Hey, can you put it back up? Okay, you run it and then you have somebody bid against you, like you didn't bid a little while ago, why you bid yeah, against me? And, and I don't I, get it, but it's just there's times that, you know, I guess people know that, oh, if, if, if I'm bidding on it, then it must be something good. So it, it kind of it mm. kind of backfires on me, too, because I'm like, I don't know. I don't like the, Guys, I mean, but the, you, the, you, the, the answer. The answer to that is is emotions is exactly what happened to Ulysses. That's why traders, they put a, a, a point when, where the, the, yeah, where, the where, where, where their bids go down and that's the limit. And they also have a limit to when it goes up. To when to sell and, w and when and when to buy, so someone doesn't want to buy something on thirty bucks, but once they're already in there on twenty, they they go up to fifty because they are, because their emotions is like I'm not gonna lose it for five, I'm not gonna lose it for ten, I'm not gonna lose. It's it's emotions. That's that's the thing because the person, if they see the actual price that is thirty dollars, they know oh no I'm not gonna pay thirty for that. I don't I don't want it. I want it in twenty five. But once you you're in there on seventeen, it's like. Is the, is, is and, that, and the thing if, it's, if, it's, if it's all for uh, like two dollars, one dollar, and then she's like, I'm not gonna let it go for two dollars, and I'm not, and then once you're in it, if you're in it for thirty, you're in it for for thirty five, you're in it for thirty five, you're in it for yeah, forty, you're in it for forty, you for, and then you're like, and sometimes it becomes like um, who's who, who has the biggest thing. who yeah. has the biggest yeah. 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 yeah exactly, yeah. and that's and that's the thing that's that's what we talk about is, you know, there's times that. You think, okay, I want to set price. And that's that's what the seller did. He decided, like, you know, nobody's going to buy this set. I bet you if I break it, I break it up. And, and, that, and, that, and, and that He wanted to sell it, and he he got his money worth. Yeah, he got his money worth. And that's, and that's what happens. I mean, it's, a, it's all a psyche thing. I mean, it, it could have been all different reasons, like you said. Maybe that individual that bought the Goku said, I don't need and, nobody and, else. It's Goku. not only that, but exactly going back, referring to what I was saying, it's not a ton hunt. It's, it's just kind of like toe fishing. And when you're fishing and fishing, and then you, 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 I, I'm not a much of an expert on, on fishing, but once you get a, a bite and they're like, it's you exciting. Get excited yeah, and it's like, exciting. Oh my God, I've been waiting for an hour. <laughs> I cannot let this go. And exactly. I've seen people, yeah. and one time we were fishing, uh, I, I was still you know, in Mexico. We were just single and <laughs> we we're a group of friends and we were just, just messing around, having fun. And then we, we, we didn't catch anything all night, right? So, and then all of a sudden, like, through three, two, three, 3 p 3 a.m. We caught something and they're like we got excited. We get it really in and like everybody like super excited. Oh, let me go, let me go, let me go. And we got it so close to the shore, and then and That's then, and, lost it. and then, it wasn't me. It was my friend. Uh -huh. right? And then he lost it. He jumped up the line, and then my friend jumped into the water. <laughs> You're not gonna get it, but he, he was so desperate. Like I'm not gonna let it go. He jumped in the water, tried to catch it with his bare hands. It was not gonna happen. Oh, man, but it's funny. that like you know you've been fishing that's for hours. Analogy, Once you get a bite, yeah. you you don't want to let it go. You it, jump in the water. That's why you jump in the <laughs> yeah, water. Like I'm really? not gonna let it go for twenty for. And I feel like that's that's why it's such a good yeah. reference when it comes to like it's not toy hunting. It's more like toy fishing. But it, it, it like once you're once you're reeling it in. You're like I, I, I cannot let it go for two dollars for five dollars. Yeah. And then just but, but you know at, all at, of a sudden you were like. Max bid at five hundred, and then you end up at like eight hundred thousand. Yeah, it at, gets crazy. At the end of the day, all in all, I think I, I like this. I like that there's still competition like this out there because that makes you understand that there's still a market. Yes, that, that, that makes that makes that makes me aware that there's still people out there that are that are willing, willing and dealing to you know go the extra mile. And I I, I mean at the end of the day, it, sometimes it sucks if you miss the piece, but then like man, there's still people out there that are, that are willing to. To go out all out, all out and, and spend you know some money on on some rare pieces or even even on a common piece, no matter what it is, people are still out there. Yeah. So that that's at the end of the day, that's what I'm I'm more worried about that than anything else because I just want to make sure to that keep the 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 the, 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 the hobby yeah, alive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're a seller, so yeah. Hey, well, yeah, yeah, that's yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That's exactly. That's no, so. but I, yeah, I, I, it's I think I think it's gonna be hard to to for this to die. I I, I don't know what's gonna happen in the future, but. Nobody knows. I, that. And nobody knows what's in the future. So, best advice: enjoy what you have. Enjoy. Go yes. at your pace. Don't go crazy. Don't overpay too much for your budget, like I did. But uh, but but yeah, enjoy enjoy the hobby. I I don't know how long it's gonna last. I don't know how long we're gonna last. Well, I don't know, but you're falling apart. I'm. Still I know. Good. I, I I was so close. <laughs> I was so close a couple of weeks ago, but. 
but yeah enjoy enjoy what you have keep exactly. the keep the keep the hobby alive keep 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 hunting yep and you know thank you guys thank you guys we're gonna cut it out right there uh thank you for for watching um leave in the comments what's your you know what was your thoughts about it like the video share subscribe guys subscribe subscribe it guys. helps a lot it helps a lot right uh, uh, is that needs a new pair of shoes guys subscribe <laughs> please subscribe thank you guys thank you. thank you thank you <laughs> thank you see you <laughs> thank you say yes bye bye, bye.